Hi, this is Carl Mullen. I'm going to talk to you about performance testing using CA service virtualization. For this demonstration, I'm going to be using a demonstration application consists of a web server, ASP, inventory, and loan server. The inventory has a separate database, and there it's running on a separate server. So for to test to see if I can meet my load my SLA of 100 simultaneous users. I've got a performance test where I'm going with five rest steps reading from a list of 280 VIN numbers. So we'll actually run this test and I'm going to run it with 100 simultaneous users. It's running. And I've got errors already. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to uh, reset my ESB to go against a virtual service. So I've recorded my inventory and now I'm virtualizing this. So I now have a virtual service representing my uh, inventory service. So we'll go back here and we'll rerun that same test again with the same list, uh, same configuration of 100 virtual users so that I can test it. My web application and my ESB run properly. So let's run that and see if we can load requirement now that we have a virtual service backing it instead of the undersized infrastructure. And we do. It runs it. As a matter of fact, I can actually, with that virtual service, I can go much higher levels of performance with virtual services. We can actually, running against that virtual service, I can go uh, 750 users and run that test, that same exact test with 750 virtual users uh, against that virtual service. Takes a little bit. We've got so many uh, running against it, but as you can see, it passed. And that's with 750 virtual users. So with service virtualization, I can take out my limitations, even do my ESB, and accomplish my testing at a much higher level than I can using uh, low-level infrastructure, undersized infrastructure in development and test.